I've got a question. What? All right, I've got a question mm -hmm. that, Jim, you probably aren't in a position to answer, I'll speak for the board, but this is just something that's running through my mind. When this was voted for, some people thought it was a good idea. Where I sit in my mind is that if we have a budget for this, would it be prudent to put a cap on it, actually first come, first served in some cases, um, so that we're not in a position, if we're overexpended in this to the point of 157%, then that other money is coming out of something else. And no, it, 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 you know what? I'm, I'm not, and it's not putting you in a position. I'm thinking out loud, saying if we if we backed ourselves into a corner with a program that we're now taking money from some other pot somewhere, something, and we're in a default budget, so we don't have a lot of room here. Okay, that we already, and this is only the end of April, at 157 percent. Do we need this to cap it much. at the budget recommendation period, first come, first served? Mar March, March's numbers were exactly the same. So this happened in January. Or it happened early in the year. Well, I don't, yeah. I don't know. So this is just a question. Maybe it is. I understand what you're saying. I'll bring it back to the board. Okay. It's, it's, it's a financial question. It's a money question. It's a line that's been, you know, really spent. Way yeah, over spent. Is it maybe a contractual question, Jim? Is mm -hmm. I don't know. I will bring it back okay. now. Would we'll this be part of the contractual agreement that allows them the capability to do this? I will, I will get an answer. All right.